वेलकम टू केमिस्ट्री क्लासेस बाय विजय कुमार सेठी क्लास 11th केमिस्ट्री यूनिट 1 सम बेसिक कांसेप्ट्स ऑफ केमिस्ट्री इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट व्हाट इज केमिस्ट्री केमिस्ट्री इन एंशिएंट इंडिया इंपॉर्टेंस ऑफ केमिस्ट्री एंड क्लासिफिकेशन ऑफ मैटर फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल व्हाट इज साइंस फ्रॉम 6th ऑनवर्ड वी आर स्टडीइंग साइंस देन व्हाट इज साइंस कंटीन्यूअस ह्यूमन एफर्ट to systematize knowledge for describing and understanding nature is called science in very simple way we can say systematic study of nature is called science science is subdivided into various disciplines like chemistry physics biology geology etc come to chemistry what is chemistry the branch of science that studies the preparation properties structure and reactions of substances is called chemistry chemistry deals with the composition structure properties and interaction of matter chemistry is also called the science of atoms and molecules there are number of branches of chemistry few are like organic chemistry in organic chemistry physical chemistry analytical chemistry biochemistry etc chemistry in ancient india in ancient india chemistry was called rasayan shastra रस तंत्र रस क्रिया और रस विद्या सुश्रुत संहिता एक्सप्लेन्स द इंपॉर्टेंस ऑफ एल्कलीज चरक संहिता मेंशंस एंशिएंट इंडियंस हु न्यू हाउ टू प्रिपेयर सल्फ्यूरिक एसिड नाइट्रिक एसिड एंड ऑक्साइड्स ऑफ कॉपर टिन एंड जिंक टिन एंड जिंक द सल्फेट्स ऑफ कॉपर जिंक एंड आयरन एंड द कार्बोनेट्स ऑफ लेड एंड आयरन सिल्वर टिन एंड कोपर है बुक रसार नवम Rasar Navam appeared around 800 CE. CE stands for Current Era. It discusses the usage of various furnaces, ovens, and crucibles for different purposes. It describes methods by which metals could be identified by flame color. Chakrapani discovered mercury sulfide. the credit for inventing soap also goes to him varha meets brith sahita is a sort of encyclopedia which was composed in the 6th century ce it informs about the preparation of glutinous material to be applied on walls and roofs of houses and temples atharveda 1000 BCE before current era BCE means before current era mention some dye stuff the material used for turmeric madder it is one plant sunflower opi opiment that is opiment this is a bright yellow mineral consisting of a arsenic trisulfide formerly used as a dye and artist pigment cochineal a red color dye used for coloring food made from the crushed dried bodies of a female scale insect and lark varha meets prat sahita gives references to perfumes and cosmetics gandha yukli ya gandha yukli describes recipes for making scents mouth perfumes bath powders incense and talcum powder vedas and kautilyas ar shastra mention about many types of liquors charak sahita also mentions ingredients such as bark of plants stem flowers leaves wood cereals fruits and sugar cane for making aswads acharya kanad आचार्य कनद बोर्न इन 600 BCE बिफोर करंट एरा ओरिजिनली नोन बाय द नेम कश्यप वाज द फर्स्ट प्रोपोनेंट ऑफ द एटॉमिक थ्योरी इज इट क्लियर 
आचार्य कनद व द फर्स्ट प्रोपोनेंट ऑफ एटॉमिक थ्योरी ही फॉर्मुलेटेड द थ्योरी ऑफ वेरी स्मॉल इनडिविजिबल पार्टिकल्स व्हिच ही नेम्ड परमाणु कंपेरेबल टू एटम्स ही ऑथर्ड द टेक्स्ट वैशेषिका सूत्र वैशेषिका सूत्र सूत्रास वैशेषिका सूत्रास चरक संहिता इज द ओल्डेस्ट आयुर्वेदिक एपिक ऑफ इंडिया चरक संहिता डिस्क्राइब्स द यूज ऑफ भस्मा क्लियर भस्म इन हिंदी भस्म इन इंग्लिश भस्मा ऑफ मेटल्स इन द ट्रीटमेंट ऑफ अलमेंट्स नाउ व डेज इट हैज बीन proved that basmas have nano particles of metals is it clear this is about ancient india chemistry now come to the importance of chemistry chemistry plays very important role in our life every instant of our life is affected by the chemistry is it clear principles of chemistry are applicable in diverse areas such as weather patterns functioning of a brain and operation of a computer production in chemical industries manufacturing fertilizers alkalis acids salts dyes polymers drugs soaps detergents metals alloys etc including new material it also plays an important role in meeting human needs for food health care products and other material aimed at improving the quality of life chemistry provides methods for the isolation of life saving drugs from natural sources and makes possible synthesis of such drugs some of these drugs are cisplatin and taxol which are effective in cancer therapy cisplatin and taxol are effective in cancer therapy the drug azt what is the meaning of azt azithromycin azithromycin okay is used for helping aids patients with the better understanding of chemical principles it has now become possible to design and synthesize a new material having specific magnetic electrical and optical properties and this has led to the production of super conducting ceramic super conducting means we can say that is zero resistance that is super conductors super conducting ceramics conducting polymers generally we know that polymers are insulator but now with the help of chemistry such polymers are synthesized which are conducting electricity optical fibers you are familiar with this term optical fibers etc chemistry contributes to a large extent in the development and growth of nation chemistry has helped in establishing industries which manufacture utility goods like acids alkalis dyes polymers a yeah, polymer this is m e r polymer metals etc these industries contribute in a big way to the economy of nation and generate employment chemistry has helped in dealing with some of the pressing aspects of environmental degradation with a fair degree of success this is the importance of chemistry but in nutshell we can say chemistry is important in supplying of food chemical fertilizers insecticides fungicides pesticides preservatives to test the presence of adulterants whatever the chemicals required in all these these are supplied by chemistry contribution to better health and sanitation discovery of sulfur drugs penicillin life saving drugs like cisplatin taxol azt discovery of anesthetics saving the environment cfc chlorofluorocarbons which destroy the ozone layer replaced by environmental friendly chemicals increase in comfort pleasure and luxuries synthetic fibers building materials supply of metals articles of domestic use entertainment all these are due to chemistry 
transport and communication fossil fuels very important for the transport alternative sources of energy application in industry every industry use the chemicals okay useful role in glass cement paper textile leather dye paints pigments petroleum sugar plastics pharmaceutical industries application in war this is the negative effect of chemistry explosive tnt tri nitro toluene nitroglycerin and dynamite these are synthesized and used in the war poisonous gases like mustard gas and phosine etc this is chemistry importance of chemistry in nutshell but there are some challenges for the future generation of chemists management of greenhouse gases like methane carbon dioxide etc understanding of biochemical processes use of enzymes for large scale production of chemicals and synthesis of new exotic materials okay nature of matter in the lower classes you discussed anything which has mass and occupies space is called matter and on the basis of physical state matter can be classified as solid liquid and gas and all of you know characteristics of solids particles are held very close to each other in solids and there is not much freedom of movement solids have definite volume and definite shape liquids the particles are close to each other but they can move around liquids have definite volume but do not have definite shape that shape depend on the container in which liquid kept gases the particles are far apart as compared to those present in solid or liquid state and their movement is easy and fast gases have neither definite volume nor definite shape with the help of this diagram you can understand like this is solid closely packed particles liquid some space is there gases large space is there okay solid liquid and gas and these states of matter are interconvertible by changing temperature and pressure okay solid may convert into the liquid liquid may convert into gas and reverse of this also possible if we cool gas will convert into liquid and liquid will convert into solid and on the basis of chemical composition or chemical nature matter is classified into the two categories mixtures and pure substances mixtures are further classified as homogeneous and heterogeneous mixture and pure substances are further classified as elements and compounds and all about these that is homogeneous mixture heterogeneous mixture elements and compounds we have discussed in the lower classes okay students subscribe my channel to get the new video thank you